Hello and welcome to the new session of that scenario based questions. My name is Alok Kumar and today we are going to discuss on the new Terraform scenario based interview questions. You have a Terraform configurations that creates multiple resources in a specific order. So in the Terraform you can write or you can create multiple resources. Okay. And that resources we need to deploy in a specific order but you need to skip a specific resource in the sequence so you don't need to deploy a specific resources you have to eliminate it how you can accomplish this in terraform so the terraform allow you to skip a specific resources in the resources by using the dash target flag you have to apply it this is the options with the terraform apply command the task target options allow you to specify a specific resources to create or update while skipping all the other resources Let's take an example. Suppose you have a Terraform configurations that create three resources in an order. A network interface, a security groups and an EC2 instance. If you want to skip the security group and only create the network interface and EC2 instance, then you have to write a command in this way. terraform apply okay and then you have to put the target options okay in that case you will write here the aws underscore network underscore interface And whatever the internal name in my case suppose example this is the internal name we taken okay so we will use this particular resources to be created and the target again and this is equal to aws underscore instance okay and again example this is also again a internal name so in this example the dash target options okay is used to specify the aws network underscore interface dot example and aws in instance dot example resources while skipping the aws security groups so it will not create created terraform will create the network interface first and then create the EC2 instance without creating the security group. It is also important to note that using the dash target options can cause issues with the resources dependency and can potentially create an ins inconsistent state also. Therefore, it is generally recommended to avoid using the dash target options and instead modify your target Terraform configurations to explicitly define the order of creations and dependency between the resources. So how we can do that? So in this example, you can modify your Terraform configurations to define the dependency between the security groups and the EC2 instance and use the depends on parameters. This one. To specify the order of the creations. So you create the AWS security groups, AWS interface, but the AWS instance have the dependent on these two resources. This needs to be created first. Then the AWS instance will be created. Okay. So by using the depends on parameters, the Terraform will create the security group first and then the network interface and finally the EC2 instance ensuring that the resources are created in the correct order that dependency in a respected way 
so in con conclusion we can say that while the target options can be useful in certain scenarios it is generally recommended to avoid using it and instead modify your terraform configurations to explicitly define resources dependency and creations order this ensures that your infrastructure is created and updated in a consistent and a predictable manner so what is your expectations it will perform those steps only if you like the video please subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends as well have a nice day thank you